Today is Veterans Day. And more important than any market, more important than anything else, thank you to you veterans, your families, the current active members. Thank you. It is because of you I get to do this daily update daily and the other stuff I get to do. And I thank you and I salute you. What's up, everybody? Welcome aboard. It is Bubba's Eye Update for Thursday, uh, November 11th, Veterans Day, of course. Once again, we'll give one more thank you because there's never enough thank yous for what they do for this country. In the meantime, markets are kind of sloppy. It's one of those crazy days. You know, part of the markets are open, part of the markets are closed. You've got, uh, you know, bonds are closed, although they trade electronically, but they're closed. The banks are closed. You're, the currencies are not trading normally. So it's a, it's a very mixed kind of picture. I think the whole market should be closed, but whatever. It's open. I can't argue. I've been arguing this point for 40 years. I guess I'm never going to win. In the meantime, the Dow is down about 70. The NASDAQ is up about 90. Uh, S&P is up 8. And the Russell's up 168. At the end of the day, we're long them all. That's, that's the simple part. And we'll just continue to be long because the, even with yesterday's sell-off, that didn't really do any major damage. That really just came down to some support. Um, the dollar index is higher and we're long. We reversed this morning. Uh, the Bitcoin is down about 800 at about uh, 65,000. Hey, look, <laughs> it got close to 70 and it's probably going to take it out probably this week. Crude is higher and we're long. It, crude has been really wild. You know, yesterday got clobbered and today it was, it's been, it's at about a $2 range today. Uh, we're still long. Um, Gold and silver are higher and we're long and they both broken out of some very important resistance levels. Now, don't be surprised when you see a pullback. There should be a pullback to that support level that was resistance. And so do not be surprised when that happens. Okay. It's not bearish. It is natural. And the truth of the matter is it's better off if you get a pullback sometimes than when they just keep going straight up. Because when they go straight up, that means it's being moved on Emotional reasons, not real good solid fundamentals or other things like that. Okay. Uh, copper is, is pushing much higher today. We're short. It's up about eight and a half cents. Uh, natural gas is higher and we are short. Uh, platinum, which I forgot to mention, but platinum is also higher, but platinum is not quite reached. It's got about 10 bucks more to go to get to that key resistance of 1100. Uh, the bonds and notes are flattish. Okay. And we have reversed our notes. So we are long bond short notes. Uh, in the in the uh, grain markets, corn higher, beans higher, wheat exploding, 821 on wheat. My God, it's a very political commodity. If you haven't heard the news, uh, Russia's holding back. But in the meantime, corn is up eight and, and beans are up as well. We're still short beans, but we are long uh, corn and wheat. And in the protein complex, uh, hogs are slightly higher. We're, we're long or we're long them all. Feeders are flat, which, now again, this goes back to what I tell you all the time. Don't get so enamored with the higher corn prices that feeders have to go down. Feeders are flat and corn's up eight cents, okay? Fat cattle is slightly lower as well, basically flat, okay? And in, in, the, in, the, in the sauce, you've got uh, cotton is higher and we are long. Coffee is exploding and we are long. Sugar is higher and we are long. Cocoa is lower and we are short. And OJ is higher and we are short, okay? So again, to you, to my words to all of you are very simple. Okay. Just be careful. It's a quiet day. We just finished day trading and we escaped and made some money today. But overall, it, I told everybody that I'm done for the day and I am done for the day. This is the update will be the end of my trading day today. Uh, we do have, uh, but today's Thursday. We got football tonight, right? Football in America and Baltimore Colts. If you can lay seven or under, lay it. Seven halves a little bit trickier. You know, that backdoor cover comes into play. And we are commercial free today in honor of our veterans. So in the meantime, once again, veterans, thank you. Thank you for your service. Thank you for making our country great. Okay. And we know even with what's going on right now, it will, we, will be, we will become great again. And it'll be most likely thanks to all of you. We appreciate you. Thank you. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you back here again tomorrow with another Bubba's Daily Update.